Well, the first thing you do when you start a quarry is you do these core drilling to map out the formation of the stone, to see how large of a formation we're talking about, to see if there's any changes in the depth of the material as you go further down into the formation, because we don't want to start into a material and have to discontinue it six months down the line. And once you've established that, that's when you first start actually excavating the what we call overburden, the top soil uh, that's covering the formation of the stone. Only then you finally start to get usable stone. The first thing they start to do is they'll do jackhammer drilling, and then they'll establish a bench. Uh, they'll lower the bench, and then from that bench, they'll create blocks that are transportable on a truck. Once they create the blocks that are transferable to the factory, uh, they'll start processing slabs under the gang saw uh, or tiles under a block saw. Most factories have jumbo gang saws, which can cut 150 slabs at one time. And then for those very delicate and difficult materials, we use a, a diamond wire saw. It's a much more costly way to cut a slab, but your recovery rate and your efficiency of cutting is much higher, opposed to the traditional gang saw. The reason why the, the synthetic diamonds are used is because it has a hardness of uh, 10 on a Mohs scale. And typically, granites uh, are rated about anywhere from 5 to a 7 on a Mohs scale, 10 being the hardest. So it's a harder material cutting a softer material. Water is very important because if you didn't use water, you would burn up the diamond blades. If you didn't use water with the carbide particles, uh, the slurry would not occur. Honing is a, a stage in between the raw surface of the slab and the actual polished state of the slab. Slabs are frequently book matched, meaning they are cut, polished on alternating sides, and packed to keep the slabs together that create a mirror-like image. This allows for a consistent flow and pattern in a stunning installation. 95% of our slabs have a process called resin face treatment. It's not to strengthen the integrity of the slab, but more to improve the aesthetic appeal of the slab. It fills in the microfissures and pits. Once the, the resin is dried, then it goes through a polishing process. And most of the resin is uh, eliminated at that point, except for the areas where it has the microfissures and pits. For fragile materials, a mesh backing is adhered to the back of the stone to protect it throughout the handling and fabrication process. Once that is done, the slabs are bundled up into wooden bundles, and then it will be loaded onto container vessels, usually mega vessels that hold anywhere from 6,000 to 8,000 containers per vessel, and shipped to either Los Angeles or uh, Houston. Once the uh, materials uh, arrive at the designated branches, they offload the truck, they unbundle the crates, uh, they'll put the slabs on an A-frame, uh, and that is the first opportunity the, the customers has to view the actual slabs. At Andrew Lauren, we use state-of-the-art laser templating systems to create a digital representation of your countertops. After selecting your slabs from Arizona Tile or at your Home Depot store, we begin the fabrication of your one-of-a-kind custom granite countertops. Using volcanic heat and pressure over the course of millions of years, the slabs of natural stone you selected were forged. And today, using computer-aided design and computer-aided manufacturing software, combined with NC and CNC technologies, your countertop begins to take shape. But only after the experienced hands of our veteran stone fabricators have polished and sealed the last piece is your natural stone countertop ready for installation.
once installation begins, one of our highly experienced installation teams will deliver your countertops and ensure that they fit just right. They'll cut out for your sinks and cooktops and ensure your countertops are level and smooth. At Andrew Lauren, our installers are carefully chosen and reviewed to ensure your countertops are installed at a quality exceeding industry standards. All with the goal of making your countertops look and perform their best for years to come. Start today by talking to your Home Depot associate about Andrew Lauren granite countertops and imagine your kitchen, a work of art millions of years in the making.